relational mapper. Uh, I might have said something different. Sometimes I call it manager or uh, mapping or something like that. You just you know, if you guys want the real definition, just Google it. Okay. But anyway, so we are retrieving data. All right, with Eloquent, which is pretty cool, using the where method, first fail, just to make sure that we find the first one. If not, we throw an exception, right? It's time for us to start using Eloquent to insert data. Let me show you how easy this is. And if I didn't make a comment, make sure that you do, okay? I think I made a comment right here, but you should make a comment for every uh, functionality. So if you're going to read data, find data, make a comment for it, okay? All right, so let's create a route real quick. This route is going to be for inserting right so let's just um, give it a different name basic insert just a basic insert okay all right and um, let's get open the closure function here all right beautiful so for basic insert what we have to do is call the the actually instantiate this so we're gonna say um, post and we can say something like this new post that's it right now we access each property or each column in, my, in our table like this so if I want to update or not update I want to insert something for the title all I do is get the property out and assign a value to it new ORM uh, title or something like that okay or well, you could just say eloquent eloquent title insert and then for the content we just do content and we'll say wow eloquent it's really cool look at this content <laughs> look at that and then if I wouldn't just save it all I have to do is this save or insert it all right this save method will insert the record all right and we'll also update it if you need to update it all right so you see leave it the way it is and let's go to the browser real quick and Right here, which is say basic, oops, basic insert, enter. All right, cool. Let's go to the uh, PHP my admin and let's refresh it. And we have actually inserted a record. All right, so this 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 is going to insert it. All right. Now, if you notice that this also what it did was that it also created a created ad and updated ad stamps now if you want to use a save method as an uh, to update what you need to do is first you need to find find the record you want right you find the record you want and then you can use a save method to update it all right If you want, we can do this right now in the next post. Let's actually do it real quick so that way you can see. I'm just going to copy, okay? So that way we do this fast. And we're going to find the record. Actually, let's leave it like that. That's fine. We don't need a new. We don't need to instantiate it. This is a, a static uh, method, all right? So find. We're going to find that. And I think we have... Uh, you gotta look at your 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 database table to see what um, fields you have. So we got I didn't know, this one is two. Let's update this one since this one has a small title, right? So we're gonna find number two, and I'm gonna change this to say new eloquent title insert number two, and the content number two. Okay. So now if I go to basic insert, and I'm gonna put a number two here. That way it's different come here and I'm gonna say basic insert number two enter oops doo -doo -doo -doo. there we go Refre refresh 
And as you can see, number two has been in updated. All right, pretty cool stuff. Now, we can also use the update method. We'll do that in the, ne in the next lecture, okay? And it's going to be a pretty fast lecture. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next lecture, guys. Very good job if you're following me. Take care.